Mount Pleasant Waterworks is trying to figure out what to do with an 84-year-old water tower with a high maintenance cost. It still serves, though, an important purpose. News 2's Charleston County reporter Natalie Price explains. When you grow up here, it's just part of the landscape, you know. Okay. But it's surprising. I didn't even know that it wasn't even a functioning water tower. You can see the Old Village water tower from all over Mount Pleasant, or at least you may think it's a water tower. It actually hasn't been for decades, not since the reverse osmosis plant was opened. But just because it's dry doesn't mean it's useless. These days, it's functioning as a cell tower. Did you know that this functions as a cell tower? I did not and actually grew up here and I've always known that water tower to be here. Mount Pleasant Waterworks leases the tower to AT&T, Sprint and T-Mobile. It collects revenue that helps keep water costs down as well as provide cell service to the old village. But that could come to an end. The tower is 84 years old and now Mount Pleasant Waterworks is looking for ways to lessen the maintenance expenses and liability of keeping that tower standing. One thing is for sure, people in the old village want their cell phones to work. Well, I already feel the cell service here is really poor, especially in this area. And so with the spotty well cell service, I need it. <laughs> and if, with getting in touch with my middle schooler and I work for my cell phone. Um, so if I found that it wasn't here, it would it would be a problem. Waterworks has presented a few different options to the community for solving the problem. They could remove the tank completely, a $100,000 project that would get rid of safety concerns and maintenance costs, but it would also eliminate wireless service. They could repair the tank, a million dollar short term fix. They could put in a tower, a big project that would have a bulky look, or they could put in a monopole, not as bulky, but quite tall. The best solution will be the least intrusive wireless signal improving option for the lowest price and Mount Pleasant Waterworks wants to hear what you have to say. Mount Pleasant Waterworks will hear public comment on this issue until the 22nd. In the studio tonight, Natalie Price, Count On 2.